it is me, and not only today do we have a double Sip Spy unboxing, but we also have a Harney and Sons unboxing in a rather large box, so I've already taken the tape off, and whoa, that got blurry really quickly. Sorry about that. And without further ado, let's get into it, shall we? And it looks super cute with its wrapping. I absolutely adore Harney and Sons wrapping. It's just so pretty and such a wonderful touch. So first thing I see right here on top is a tea for a certain mummy of mine, and it is the Mother's Bouquet Tea, and it's just a such a cute little tin, and it says, it is a wonderful caffeine-free blend of flowers accented with orange flavor. The, this aromatic bouquet honors all mothers and their valued efforts for their family, and the ingredients are rose petals, chamomile, cornflowers, orange peel, and orange oil, and it is just such a cute little tin, and I definitely think my mom is going to absolutely love this for Mother's Day. Although, I guess if you live in the UK, Mothering Sunday has already happened, so to those in the UK, happy Mother's Day to you. Belated, I should say. Next is something that I picked up on sale and I actually had a whole bunch of Harney and Sons rewards saved up and it ended up being about $47 worth of rewards. So everything here ended up, I think I paid like maybe $12 for everything, maybe a bit more, but I was just super excited to use my rewards and get this little, well, I guess late Christmas present for myself. If I can get, there we go, the tape off. Wow, very securely wrapped. Yay! So as we can see, it's in this absolutely stunning, beautiful green, two-tone green box. Absolutely love it, and the ribbon. And this was the white Christmas gift set. And I'll just quickly open it for you, because I'm super excited to show it off, because I thought it was just the coolest, um gift set besides the ginger red one, which I'm still hoping to get if it comes back in stock. So here we go. If I can get it open. There we go. So of course, lovely tissue paper. And here it is. Oh, oh. So first thing on top, we have coconut ginger chocolate. I'm super excited because this is um, infused with their tea, Organic Bangkok, and I absolutely love that tea. Next, we have some lovely Meyer lemon marmalade. And I'm super excited to try this out because I love all things lemon. I love citrusy flavors a lot. Next, we have some brown butter cookies. Or if you're from other parts of the world, I guess you call these biscuits. But here it's cookies and it is Swedish cookies and I'm super excited to try them because mm, who doesn't love cookies? And speaking of which, yay! We have the little shortbread cookies here with the little bunny family. And it's so cute on the back of the different flavored teas. They come with a little story, so I'll hold it up here. And if you want to stop the video and read it, it's just super sweet. And it talks about the little bunny family and their Christmas. So if I remember right, this one is, um, I think it's just the regular, yes, this is the regular shortbreads, but other ones are infused with Harney and Sons tea, and they're absolutely mm, splendid. Next is a tin of the white Christmas tea. It is a white tea with vanilla and almond, so it's kind of a marzipani flavored tea, and the tin is uh, just gorgeous. I am a sucker for beautifully designed tea tins or just boxes in general. And then last but certainly not least in this box, we have green tea with coconut, ginger, and vanilla. It's also known as Bangkok in the sachet version, but this is my absolute favorite, favorite Harney and Sons tea. It just, ugh, I, I just cannot get enough of this tea. I absolutely love it. I think I've rambled on about it in different videos, but yeah, I absolutely love it. And this tea tin is part of the Historic Royal Palaces collection, and uh, again, 
Awesome. So that is that little haul done. And if you're interested in picking up anything from Harney and Sons, I do have a coupon down below that you can use and save some fabulous money on your own Harney and Sons order, which in um, shipping wise, it is free for um, the continental United States. So that is a, another awesome plus for them. So up next, let's get into our Sips by boxes. So we have February and March's Sips by box. So let's get out our trusty pocket knife and get into it, shall we? Now, if you're unfamiliar with SipSpy, it is a really cool um, monthly subscription service and every month you get four different teas personalized just for you. You just take a quick little quiz and each box is absolutely unique, which I adore. Um, they were one of my very first subscription boxes. It was SipSpy and Owl Crate back in the day. So I've been doing this since 2018. Wow. So if you're interested in picking up your own box, there is a link down below for $5 off. So here is February's tea and it is made just for me. And it says, hi, while winter chills still linger, our wishes is that you discover new favorite teas to cozy up and keep warm with. We're cheering you from afar, so don't forget to share a cup of with us. And it says, you know, you can enter their Instagram challenge and get a free month's box. So XOXO Team Sips by. So of course, first thing right on top is the reusable drawstring bag. And within we have a couple of little disposable drawstring baggies, which are always nice in case you are gifting this or you're new to loose leaf teas, you have your own little infuser bags. So first things I see on top is a couple baggies from Miracle Tree. Ooh, I have had some of them before from this brand. So we have four little bags of that and it is organic Moringa Super Superfood Energy Tea Orange Passion Fruit. Ooh, I love orange and I love passion fruit. So this should be a good combination. And there's a little back of our baggie. Up next, oh, it's so cute. This is Cookie Tea White Chocolate Chip Cookie. And it's just the cutest little packaging. I mean, look, they even have a little Pippi right there. Pippi is currently on the bed asleep and she is sleeping like a person right now with, you know, sleeping on her back. So she's not fooling anybody. We all know that she's a tiny person in a cat suit. So on the back we have the ingredients and it's just cute. It looks like a little recipe card and it's just so sweet. I love good packaging if I've not said that a hundred times already. Next we have four baggies of Puka Supreme Matcha Green Tea. Ooh. So we have four little baggies and there is the back. And the last tea I see is interesting because it is from Stash and it says it is Christmas Eve tea. So I think that's a little late to be in the box. I don't know. That's kind of funny that that got slipped in here. And yes, it does say Christmas Eve tea. So that is a caffeine free tea. The white chocolate chip cookie is a low caffeine. The passion fruit tea is super caffeinated. And it says it contains 155 milligrams of caffeinated tea. Ooh. And then the puka is medium. So we have caffeine free, low, medium, and super caffeinated. So I'll put that aside for now and let's take a quick peek at March's tea and I will steep some of these afterwards. So here we go with March's and trusty pocket knife. So let's see what it says. Ooh. March teas. It says, as we patiently wait for the first blooms of spring this month, let's slip slow. Let's sip slow and appreciate the cozy times for a, li a little longer. Don't forget to share a couple with us while you're at it. Snap a pic of your Sips by box and share it on social media. XOXO Team Sips by. So, ooh, pretty packaging. Sorry, got distracted. So, once again, reusable and disposable drawstring baggies. And the first one I see on top is in gorgeous 
gorgeous packaging and it's from a company I've never seen before and it is a saffron chai black tea blend Ooh, and just look at that packaging it is so gorgeous and here is the back of our tea and it says that this is from Tam Tamina Tamina teas and it is a high caffeine tea. So it is Assam tea, ginger root, cardamom, cloves, saffron, and green cardamom. Ooh, so that sounds splendid. Up next, ooh, we have a loose leaf tea and it is from Davison's Organic. And it is a classic, it is Earl Grey. Ooh, love a good Earl Grey. And it says that it is, of course, a high caffeine tea. So it is black tea and bergamot oil. And it says Earl Grey is said to be created from the second Earl of Grey in the 1800s. Ooh. So, ooh, I can smell it through the bag already. So that is absolutely great. Up next, ooh. So this is interesting. We have, we have Bacha Matcha tea. And it has a little sheeper right there and it's just a little packet of matcha and it says that it bacha, cer bacha ceremonial grade matcha is high quality matcha made from hand selected first harvest and shadow grown tea leaves for a smooth flavor that easily dissolves in water mm -hmm. so I this is the first time, or maybe the second time only, that I've gotten matcha tea in my Sesuai box, and I'm super excited to try it out. And then lastly, we have a, another loose leaf tea, and it is Golden Flourish Amore, and it says it promotes a healthy cardiovascular system. So we have a great big bag of loose leaf tea here, and it says it contains love, rose petals, hawthorn leaf, mother motherwort plant, lavender flower, and cinnamon bark. Oh, that's interesting. So this is a caffeine-free tea, and it says, keep your heart happy and full of love with our invigorating Vitality tea blends. Interesting. So that is the four teas for March. So without further ado, let's taste out some of the teas, shall we? So one moment, teas. All righty then. So starting things off, we are doing February's Orange Passion Fruit Superfood Energy Tea. And this is how it looks like steeped. And you really can see the little bits of orange peel and all the lovely goodies in here. So, taste test. Ooh, yummy, yummy, yummy. So I'm definitely getting more of the orange than the passion fruit, but you can taste the passion fruit in there and it's quite nice. Mm. It's a lovely, refreshing, quasi-tropical tea, and if you are more of a iced tea drinker, I think this would be very good iced, but hot, it's quite delicious too. Mm. Splendid! So next, let's try our chai from March. So it is the saffron chai, and I love the lovely golden color that the saffron has given the tea. It is just so rich and vibrant. I don't know if the camera can pick it up as well as it is in person, but it looks absolutely stunning. At first sniff, it smells like a really good chai tea. Hmm. So it's a pretty standard, um, chai tea. Personally, I would like it um, a little bit stronger, but I think it's pretty good. I might let it steep a bit longer. So far, it's been steeping for about five minutes. It's okay. Not exactly my favorite. I was hoping for it to be maybe a little bit stronger, a little bit better. Maybe I was just a sucker for the packaging, but it's all right. I definitely think out of the two though, the orange passion fruit is definitely my favorite out of the two I'm taste testing right now. So 
With that being said, I'm going to set down this one and grab this one right back. Mmm, yummy. Well, everybody, what do you think? Is there any specific teas that were your favorites? Did you like March's selection? Or did you like February's selection better? Or did you just prefer the Harney and Sons haul? Leave a comment down below. And if you're interested in checking out another video, you can go ahead and click right here. And if you are new, welcome to my channel and go ahead and click that subscribe button so that you never miss my videos ever again. Thank you so much for watching and I will tea you all later. Bye bye.